Uh, in this video, investor Gary Black discusses Tesla's performance and the reasons behind the brand's appeal with Meet Kevin. He talks about how Tesla overcame range anxiety by expanding the number of charging stations and lengthening the charging duration. In addition, Black thinks that future projects like the Highland Project and the Cybertruck are real and will keep expanding the realm of what is practical for electric vehicles. Despite the recent decline in stock prices, Black is still bullish about Tesla's future and thinks the Cybertruck will be a significant driver for the business. Elon Musk is still driving the business towards success, according to Gary, who opened the interview. In an interview with Meet Kevin, Gary Black addressed a common concern among the publics. Why is there such a huge demand for Tesla vehicles? This is due to a number of factors, such as early adopters who value environmental sustainability, those seeking to create a statement, and people who favor self-driving automobiles. A number of things contribute to the desire for Tesla vehicles, such as the brand's sustainability and environmental friendliness, the car's cutting-edge design and technology, and the prestige that comes with owning one. From tech-savvy auto aficionados to early adopters who are environmentally sensitive to people who just want to make a statement with their car, Tesla has created a brand that appeals to a broad spectrum of customers. A lot of interest has also been generated by the company's concentration on self-driving technology among customers who are enthusiastic about the idea of having a completely driverless car. The strong demand for Tesla automobiles and the company's notable performance in the automotive sector are both results of these characteristics. However, due to reservations regarding the price and range of electric vehicles, some prospective customers are hesitant. Your Tesla may have a greater initial cost, but it will cost less to operate and come with several benefits, including no maintenance fees and no need to buy petrol or oil. Tesla has also improved its range and charging times, which makes it a more sensible choice for long road trips. Although financing a Tesla may appear pricey, the automobile is superior in practically every aspect when compared to other vehicles of a comparable caliber. For individuals who buy electric vehicles, there's also a tax credit available. Uh, people are unlikely to return to conventional gas-powered cars after they make the, the conversion to electric vehicles. Range anxiety is one of the main reasons people are reluctant to convert to electric vehicles. This indicates that they are concerned that if they take a long drive, their batteries may run out. However, because there are a growing number of charging stations available. Range anxiety has been less of a concern over time with its network of superchargers. Tesla is among the businesses that have been setting the standard in this area. Although petrol stations are widely distributed, superchargers are still less popular. Nevertheless, Tesla is attempting to change that. Um, some of the rumors you've heard about Tesla, such as the Highland Project or the impending Cybertruck, may or may not be true. Investor Gary Black, however, says they're not. He believes Elon Musk, who led the firm to its current state, is a great and imaginative CEO. Yeah. Although Gary occasionally comes across as a whiner, he still has a large portion of his money invested in Tesla. After Google, it's his second largest investment. He's also made investments in Chipotle. Uh, but what about the most recent stock price decline for Tesla? Gary believes that the trading range for Tesla will likely be between 150 and 200, even though he is still comfortable with owning a five to 6% ownership in the company and could even consider buying more if the price drops lower. Uh, it's critical to remember that projecting a company's future profits and performance is fundamentally unpredictable and dependent on a number of variables. Although it is reasonable to think of a company's margins being completely negative, most well-established and prosperous businesses are unlikely to experience this. But without additional context, it is challenging to ascertain Elon Musk's objectives with regard to his remarks. It's likely, though, that he was attempting to convey the significance of innovation and keeping on the cutting edge in a field that is changing quickly. In the end, it's critical to carry out in-depth investigation and study prior to making any investment judgments. This entails evaluating among other things, the company's market position, industry developments, and financial health. So what is the present state of affairs regarding Tesla? Uh, in any case, sales of the Model I are robust in China and the U.S. Compared to Q4, they delivered 12 more cars in Q1, representing a growth rate of roughly 57.60. Europe, where inventory levels are rather high, is a cause for concern. Although Norway is doing well, demand might not be as high in larger nations like Germany. However, all things considered, Tesla is doing well. 
and they are keeping up their innovative work and pushing the limits of what is practical for electric vehicles. Bikes and inventory are common, particularly after uh, a sizable cargo of cars arrives, like one from China. Therefore, in order to assess inventory accurately, we must go beyond this quarter's peak and compare it to the end of the first month of a prior quarter. We can determine whether the current inventory number is good or not by performing this. We are presently higher than we were in the prior quarters. We can look at uh, the graphic that stacks the models together to make it easier to compare the numbers, though not by a tremendous lot. Uh, since Tesla does not display duplicate setups, we can determine by comparing the figures on this chart that the true number is substantially greater than 4,000. This is the general basis for our rating of Tesla 5.5. The Cybertruck, in my opinion, is the primary catalyst. I'm excited to drive my Cybertruck trimotor around Chicago, valet it in front of Nobu, and watch people snap pictures of it because it's going to be something unique and amazing. I have an order for one on the way. As a moving billboard, the Cybertruck will direct traffic to the Tesla store and website just with the Apple model white. It's like an advertisement, even if customers decide not to get a Cybertruck. Um, it's different and special. And in my opinion, the best truck ever made. I have always preferred SUVs. And as I become older, I've learned to value having more space. Honestly, I'm more concerned about whether or not it will fit in the garage across the street from my house. Not just because of the million three orders, but also because it will drive customers to the website and store. The Cybertruck is a major driving force behind the entire Tesla brand. The Cybertruck will be incredible, even if just 100 are delivered the next year. The uh, semi-truck will also be spectacular, as it is already in a similar state to when Tesla was about to start producing 5,000 Model 3s a week. The coming months will reveal a lot. Allow me to explain some fascinating Tesla news. Uh, let's start by discussing the Cybertruck. I think a lot about this vehicle's success will become clear over the course of the next 12 to 18 months. Uh, I believe it might take a few years until Tesla's fully autonomous technology is ready, despite some people's optimism that it'll be available soon. There's been discussion lately on Tesla possibly lowering the price of the Model 3 to $25,000, although that would be incredible. I believe it would be more practical for Tesla. I should concentrate on a new inexpensive model. It will be known as the Model 2. Tesla can grow its client base by at least 40, 50 by adding a more cheap option to its current lineup. In China, the most competitive market in the world right now. It would be fantastic to see a manufacturing specifically for the Model 2. Uh, regarding China, Tesla has already said that it will assemble 1 million compact model. Yeah, eyes in Shanghai. But I believe it would be dangerous for them to concentrate only on China. I would be all for Tesla shares if it made up merely five or 10% of my portfolio. But at this time, I believe they should keep growing internationally while continuing to have a significant presence in China. We appreciate you seeing this film regarding Tesla and its future. As was previously mentioned, Tesla is setting the standard for the electric car market and the company's future appears bright even in the face of certain worries and stock price swings. Uh, it is anticipated that the Cybertruck and other future initiatives would uh, significantly boost the company's growth and increase awareness of Tesla's groundbreaking and inventive technologies. Uh, even though there could be some obstacles to overcome, Tesla is still pushing the envelope on what's practical for electric vehicles. We appreciate you viewing and we hope to see you soon. Make sure you hit the subscribe button and give this video a huge thumbs up.